Uh, hello everyone. I uh, hope you all well. I wanted to continue on my legend series and today I wanted to give a uh, Herbert uh, Sutcliffe uh, who I have mentioned in my previous video. Uh, I mean he is famous in, in his own rights but uh, he's uh, probably most uh, well known for being the opening partner of uh, Sir Jack Hobbs. He was born on uh, November 24th, uh, 1894 in uh, Yorkshire and he is uh, widely regarded as uh, one of the greatest uh, opening batsmen of all time in uh, uh, cricket history. And uh, together with uh, Sir Jack Hobbs, uh, they are regarded uh, widely regarded as definitely the greatest uh, opening partnership of all time. I had mentioned about this in uh, Sir Jack Hobbs video a bit and also during the World Cup video, but it's been a few months, so I'll repeat it. They actually had 38 uh, innings uh, opening partnership together and they scored an astonishing 3,249 runs at an average of uh, 87.51 or 71, more than 87, close to 88. And that is a stunning uh, average. I don't think any, any opening partnership in the history of cricket will ever come close to that. Probably more runs than that. A lot of uh, other batsmen have opening partnership have probably scored like Langer, Hayden and Haynes and Greenwich close to that, but the average is absolutely stunning. And uh, he played uh, Herbert Sutcliffe, uh, he basically played for Yorkshire first class cricket and also for MCC. And uh, he formed uh, basically three big partnership, opening partnerships in his life. Uh, one was with uh, obviously Sir Jacobs for England, then with uh, Percy Ho Holmes for Yorkshire and also with uh, young uh, Len Hutton uh, when he was towards the end of his career. I mean, young Le uh, Len Hutton, the great English batsman, I mean, in his beginning of his career, he did open a lot with uh, Herbert Sutcliffe at uh, Yorkshire. And uh, he played, uh, Herbert Sutcliffe uh, played uh, 54 test matches and he scored 4,555 runs uh, at a stunning average of uh, 60.73 and he scored 16 hundreds and his highest score was uh, 194. And in first class cricket, I mean, he has clo clo scored almost uh, 51,000 uh, runs and he has scored an astonishing 151 uh, hundreds at, at uh, first class level. And uh, he is the first person, first cricketer to score 16 test hundreds. And he also has another record, he's the first person, first fastest to 1,000 test runs. Uh, he did that in his 12th innings. He passed his 1,000 test runs in his uh, 12th test innings, which was a record, and it was equal by Sir uh, Everton Weeks of uh, West Indies later on, but it's still a record that they hold uh, together. And uh, Herbert Sutcliffe was well known for his uh, sound defense and his uh, wonderful driving through the offside, and he was also known as the best hooker of his uh, times. So, uh, he was a really good hooker of the cricket ball. And in 1924-25 against Australia in a five-test match series, he scored 734 runs with four centuries at an average of uh, more than uh, 81. Uh, and uh, he was really good uh, in that series. Uh, and with Percy Holmes uh, in 1919, uh, Percy Holmes and uh, Herbert Sutcliffe, they scored five centuries each and they also had five century partnerships together. And they were selected as the Wisden Cricketers of the Year in 1920, both of them, Percy Holmes and Herbert Sutcliffe. And Herbert Sutcliffe is uh, widely known as one of the game's uh, greatest uh, bad wicket uh, batsmen, which means he was uh, someone who was really good at batting on difficult which, uh, wickets, pitches. Uh, that is obviously a great uh, honor to have that uh, tag uh, because, I mean, when you can bat on uh, difficult, uh, bad pitches, that is when you uh, show your true worth. So he's definitely someone top uh, in that regard. I mean, someone who was regarded as uh, one of the greatest uh, in on bad wickets. And by the way, when Herbert, uh, when, uh, Herbert Sutcliffe uh, was uh, batting in his prime time for uh, Yorkshire, I mean, uh, Yorkshire won uh, 12 county championships when he was uh, in full flow. And uh, during 1925 to 27, when uh, Sutcliffe was uh, in his prime years as well, uh, there, it was a record for Yorkshire. They went uh, 70 matches unbeaten, unbeaten streak of 70 matches. And in 1927, they lost uh, three matches, Yorkshire, and they still went another 57 matches uh, without being uh, defeated. So that was a great uh, uh, span of uh, years for Yorkshire. 
So uh, Herbert Sutcliffe uh, doing a lot uh, for Yorkshire. And uh, his uh, last tour to Australia, 1932-1933, was that uh, Bodyline series, uh, famous, uh, the infamous uh, Bodyline series uh, with uh, Douglas Jardine, the captain, and uh, Harold Larwood bowling, obviously, on the body. I've mentioned about the Bodyline series uh, in a few of my videos. So that uh, last tour of Herbert Sutcliffe in 1932-33 uh, against Australia in Australia was that Bodyline series. And he is... Uh, uh, regarded as someone who was uh, close to Douglas Jardine and supported Douglas Jardine with that uh, strategy that they had, strategy that they had uh, of uh, bowling uh, on the body and that borderline series. That he is someone who supported Douglas Jardine big time uh, with that uh, uh, borderline series. Uh, so anyway, uh, Herbert Sutcliffe uh, definitely one of the greatest uh, legends of. Uh, uh, English cricket uh, and by the way uh, his 60.73 uh, the completed test average of 60.73 is the highest of all English batsmen till today uh, the highest and it is the fifth all time uh, in the test history list I mean of any batsman who has uh, batted more than 20 innings obviously for an average of that I mean Sir Don Bradman I think is now obviously Sir Don Bradman is number 199.94 uh, yeah, I think Australia's Adam Woods is also there. Then uh, Graham Pollock is also there. Uh, George Headley. Uh, George Headley is also there. Yeah, they are the top four. Uh, Herbert Sutcliffe comes uh, fifth uh, in the all-time greatest averages in Test history with the uh, 60.73 that he has. And his 151 uh, centuries in uh, first-class cricket is also one of the highest uh, of uh, first-class 100 records. Uh, Jack Hobbs has more than that. But I mean, 150 uh, first-class hundreds. Not a lot of uh, batsmen have that. So, uh, so Herbert Sutcliffe uh, having a lot of records. I'm just repeating just one more thing uh, that uh, he did. Uh, he's the first uh, cricketer to pass uh, 16 Test hundreds, number one, and number two. He's the fastest to thousand Test runs, which he completed in his 12th innings. He completed uh, thousand runs. Uh, Sir Everton Weeks uh, did equal that record, but they hold that record together. So those are the two records in uh, Herbert Sutcliffe's name. And obviously that 60.73 average is the fifth of all time and the highest by any English batsman. And also that uh, opening partnership with uh, Sir Jacobs just repeating 3,249 runs at an average of uh, 87.5. Uh, 87 or something around there. Uh, in just 38 innings uh, so they are regarded as the greatest opening uh, partnership of all time so that is my video on uh, Sir uh, sorry on uh, Sir Herbert uh, Sutcliffe uh, who was uh, one of the greatest uh, batsmen of England opening batsman uh, with uh, Sir Jacobs and also someone who did a lot for Yorkshire uh, so that is my video hope you have enjoyed it uh, please take care and uh, God bless you